Alright, hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Now on this one we are back in Shadow Vis RPG and I'm going to be showing you guys all the super boss locations. Now, uh, for those of you who don't know what a super boss is, super boss is basically um, what the, I guess what they consider like um, just a much harder boss than the others. So, okay, so the first one, you need the blue steel bathysphere or uh, just the normal bathysphere, either one. And what you want to do is you got to go over to this pond right here and then go under the water and go through this door. And this is the Knight of the Silent Abyss. This is the first super boss. He's level 5 million and his drop rewards are the dual breakers, which are the swords right here. His leggings, which I don't have yet. His chest plate, don't have yet. And his helmet, I don't have yet because they're pretty hard chances. Alright, and then the next one. Let me just get back to my other loadout. Alright, so the next super boss is in the third world. I'm just going to go to that real quick. So I did actually just make a video on this boss. Um, I wasn't able to beat him at the time, but I can now, so I'll show you that. So what you want to do is you go up here, and this, you, you can't get up here with only the Valk. You need um, the Athenian chest plate or like the Star Child stuff like uh, these things because they give flight speed so then what you want to do is you want to look up find the white pad and you want to go to that and that's where the boss located uh hold up oh yeah i forgot i don't have the valk on just give me a second all right there we go now i should be able to get up there you might need all three to get up here i'm not really sure okay so this boss is our second super boss, Kronos the Final Justice, level 25 million. Now this is currently the second um, highest level boss in the game, behind one of the other super bosses, which I will show you in this video. So this one, Kronos the Final Justice, he's a pretty difficult boss, but I can kill him pretty easily since I'm hun level 100 mil right now. And uh, yeah, so he's up here, his drop rewards are, let me just get to it real quick, because I don't remember the names of them. Okay, so his drop rewards are his leggings, which I'm... Um, am I wearing right now? I think I am. No, no, I'm not wearing them right now. Wait, no, no, sorry. I am wearing them right now. I just have a different pair. So, these are the leggings. Pretty good stats. Drops the chest plate. Pretty good stats. The sword is not honestly that good in my opinion. And then his helmet right here. All these drops are from Chronos of Final Justice. Okay, so then we'll be going on to the third super boss now. Now, the third one is located in the fourth world. It's not like a hidden boss like the other two. It's just um, they consider it a super boss because he's pretty difficult. He's level 10 million. It is the... I'll show you guys it. It's the uh, Ores, the Tarnished, tarn uh, whatever it's called. Something like that. Yeah, Ores, the Tarnished, level 10 million. So this is our third super boss, and he drops, I do have all of his drop rewards, he drops the Tarnished Aurelium, he drops the Aurelian Hood, and he also drops the Curse Blade. Um, the weapons are okay, um, the Hood's pretty good because it gives you his abilities which are pretty good, but I still say like, if you want the best weapon, oh, I actually just got the Hood there, I guess I'll just take that. Um, so. If you guys do want the best weapon, I'll go over, like, the best set that I've found so far. But the best weapon, I'm pretty sure, is from this guy. And he drops the sword that I'm using right now. It's a 10% drop chance. And, yeah, so it's definitely really good. Okay, so that that is our... Th it's got it again. It's funny how it's, like, a 1% chance. I just got it twice in a row. Let's see if I get it three times in a row. No. Okay, so... Now on to our fourth and final super boss. Now, this is the hardest one in the game by far, the hardest total boss. And this boss is located in the 5th Rebirth world, which you can get into before you're in the 5th Rebirth, but it won't matter. So, it is down here, through the blue door. It is the Sea King right up here, level 80 million. Not a very easy boss. I honestly die, like, at least once before killing it. As you guys may have seen in the video, I just uploaded on defeating the Sea King. So yeah, this is our um, fourth and final super boss. I'll try to kill him right here. 
I might have I might die and have to respawn once or twice. Cause I don't know, this boss is like really broken most of the time. Surprisingly not being too broken right now. But um a lot of the time it is and just glitches all over the place, which I think it actually might be doing now, unless I just killed it. I think I might have just killed it. Um where's the drop rewards? No idea. Okay, well, that was weird. I don't even know where the drop rewards were, so... Oh, here they are. Okay, so it's the pixie ring. It's the guarantee drop. He has two others, but I don't have them, sadly, right now. But, oh, uh, yeah. Actually, that ring is uh, probably my new best one, to be honest. Alright, so those are the, all the four super bosses. Um, not... This one is definitely the hardest. So, yeah, those are all the locations. If you guys do enjoy these videos, um, let me know in the comments what else you guys want to see on this game. And yeah, I'll be sure to upload more soon. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you all have a good day and goodbye.